Well, hi, it's Jeannie in the studio. It's Christmas time, and we are making Christmas snowflakes. And if you would like to join us to see what we're doing, welcome to the studio today. Well, here's something that I think is interesting to see. As, as you put some flux around your foiled bead, and then you run a bead of flux around the side and let some build up on that side and now look if you have done it right the other side is covered also so you only have to do around it one time and so then you can just flip your beads in place Okay, now I can just tack them in. Your solder's getting a little short. <laughs> Do your trick of putting them together. My trick? Yeah, put the two solder pieces together to make it longer. Mm -hmm. Magical. I didn't know that was a trick. <laughs> okay, now just near. So the fun part of these bevel snowflakes is that you can just use your imagination and you don't have to use beads if you don't want to the glass globs or or you can and uh it's just some fun things i'll show you a couple of different ones over here that i've been working on just playing around this one i'm going to put that one in the center and then put all these around here and there's that one that one that one so just having some fun fun Christmassy things to do today <laughs> so yours are trending towards larger shapes than mine or oh more like uh, yours were um, Remember that other video we did on snowflakes yeah. a couple years ago? Yours were much, much bigger, bigger constructions, and these are a little smaller. Yeah, these are Maybe. smaller. Yeah. Well, I think that these m maybe have uh, room. Uh, I think with these, there might be more room in your house to put them. <laughs> 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 well, mine is... Dinky, and you know, I'm I'm used to making kind them with the without anything. Uh huh. And you can. So okay. So just a quick design with snowflakes. Ready? Looks like it's going. Okay. Well, um, I didn't clean up all of this before the video because I thought you know. This is how it is. You got your, you know, some bevels out, some, some glass globs out, because you have to think, well, how is this going to go together? And you have to design it, and that's just part of the fun. 
and so you just kind of put things together as as you go so you need it all out here <laughs> right near you and that's just kind of how creators create so I've just been finishing up the last little part of the the soldering here and then this one will be done and most of these that I've been making the last few days are for gifts and I think that it will be a fun Christmas gift I was talking to a student recently about charging for these and it's so interesting I've been charging um, probably half as much as she does on her sites and I thought wow I don't want to devalue the art by not charging enough and yet on the other hand I want to make sure that everybody has the opportunity to have stained glass so if you have some ideas on, on pricing that would be interesting to me I know what we price our uh, our big windows for because we have a set price for that and but and it's too low and <laughs> David says it's too low so um, but for sun catchers especially this one because it has bevels and bevels are just more expensive and so you want to make sure that you price your work accordingly and one thing that um, one of my students who's selling her work at a gallery says is um, her husband wasn't even going to let her do it unless she not only charged for the amount that she spent on the materials but also for her time because she has children and she has him and she wants to make sure or he wants to make sure that she's charging for the time that she's spending and that's a good point <laughs> so you have to be able to to charge for your materials charge for your time and effort and make it worth your while so as you can see we're finishing up these Christmas things and let's come over here I have a few that I finished that I just want to show you So here's a few I've done. We'll put this one down here, although I will definitely clean it up. But yeah, just some fun different snowflakes from Bevels. So Merry Christmas. Well, I don't know if that was fun. It, I may just do this all day. I may just make lots and lots of these snowflakes because it's just so fun. And if you think that you've had a fun time here today too, maybe you can give us a like. Maybe you can even comment and show us some pictures of snowflakes that you've done at your house or at your studio. So thanks for being with us.